students from IPEC community. It's a great pleasure to greet you. I hope you are fine. I'm Miss Nayib from IPEC Aeropuerto. So in this time, we are going to learn together the vocabulary about natural disasters. So maybe you are learning something about this the previous weeks. So it's fine, it's okay, and I hope you will enjoy this part now. And let's take a look and go with me to learn this vocabulary. Today in this video we are going to learn something about vocabulary, also it's about natural disasters. In this case, the first word is about predict. P-R-E-D-I-C-T. Predict. It's the action to tell something that will happen in the future, but we are not sure about that. For example, the weather. We are not sure if tomorrow will rain. The second word is earthquake. E-A-R-T-H-Q-U-A-K-E. -E. Earthquake. It's a vibration on the Earth's crust that some of the times could cause a separation of the land. The third word is tsunami. T S U N A M I. Tsunami. It's a large sea wave produced by a um, sea quake or a volcanic eruption underwater. The fourth word is landscape. L A N D S C A P E. Landscape. It's a section or area of natural scenery. For example, the Popocatépetl volcano. The fifth word is warning. W A R N I N G. Warning. It's an advertisement or followed by a sound or only the sound that alert people of future damage, for example, natural disasters. The sixth word is continent. C-O-N-T-I-N-E-N-T. -E continent. is one of the five principal messes on land of the earth. For example, America, Asia, Africa, Oceania, and Europe. The seventh word is epicenter. E P I C E N T E R. Epicenter is a point on the Earth's surface where the greatest damage by an earthquake takes place. The eighth word is focus. F O C U S is the point of the origin of an earthquake. The ninth word is boundary. B O U N D A R Y. Boundary. It refers to something that divides one territory, country, city, state, etc. from another. It could be natural, like the rivers, or a line. The tenth word is plate. P L A T E. Plate. It's a rigid section of the Earth's crust that causes the continental drift when it moves. Talking about this context of natural disasters are the tectonic plates. This is the end of the video about this vocabulary, but I strongly believe that you learn the whole vocabulary. It's not difficult, but if you have any questions, you can send an email to your English teacher. And please don't forget to send your mission on time, and I will see you the next time.